Hi guys, in the last video I showed how to statically redirect USB device to a virtual machine and, and when I mean statically I mean you need to power off the virtual machine, map it, the device to the virtual machine, power it on, you cannot remove it. This time I'll show it in Windows and the last time I recorded the video it didn't work so I checked a bit and it looks like uh, the version of Virt Viewer, that's the client to connect to Windows using the SPICE protocol to view the screen. Version 8.0 on Windows doesn't work well with the USB redirection and version 7.0 works. So let's look at a few things first in order to make it work you'll need to download two files and i'll give the links in the description but basically you need to download the usb dk that's the development kit you'll need to install it while you install it it will disconnect all your usb devices and it will redirect it through the usb development kit You'll need it for the Spice uh, Vert Viewer. And you'll need to install Vert Viewer uh, 7.0 x64. Now, as I said, I'll give links both here and uh, that's the USB development kit and that's the Vert Viewer that you'll need. Now, let's go to the overt here is my windows 10 machine let's click on console and click it again now let me resize it before i'll bring it okay this should be okay i'll do a login you don't need to log in in order to redirect it. Uh, you can do it anytime you want. USB device selection. You'll see it grayed out if you didn't install the um, USB development kit that I mentioned uh, in this video. So you'll need to install first the USB development kit and then the Vert Viewer. Once we have it, we can click and select the device. So, right now, I just assigned the webcam. So let's open camera. And this is me. Hi. And, uh, yeah, this machine right now is uh, pretty heavy loaded, so you'll see it frozen. Anyway, it should work pretty well. Uh, I tested it with Skype under Windows and it works. So that's it. Basically, after you finished, you can go again, USB device selection and check it out. And you'll see it in the list again. And the device is basically mounted back to the host operating system. And that's it. Thanks for watching. Like, share, subscribe. If you have any comments, suggestions or anything, leave it in the comments below. And I'll see you in the next video.